What's going on, my friends? It is CJ Curry. It's a money making kind of Monday here on Prize Picks. Guys, if you're not playing on Prize Picks yet, you get a 100% instant deposit match on your very first deposit, all the way up to $100 when you use code Curry. Make sure that you're taking advantage of that offer if you're not playing on Prize Picks yet. I've left a link down in the description of today's video for you to get started. I'm going to bless you guys with a few picks. There's a few things that are standing out to me today. We're going to look at two different hitters from the same team going up against a pretty abysmal looking pitching matchup. Uh, we're talking about the Washington Washington Nationals versus the Colorado Rockies. And then I've also got a pitching pick for us to kind of take a look at here. A guy who's had his struggles at home in this particular player prop category, but has had some historical success against today's opponent. So guys, if you're not subscribed to the channel yet, hit the subscribe button now and definitely think about dropping a like at some point during this video. And without further ado, let's jump into today's picks. Once again, we are playing on prize picks. That's my site of choice. That's where I like to play player props. So if you're not on prize picks yet, again, take advantage of that great offer. 100% instant deposit match when you make your first deposit uh, using code Curry. Okay, so let's take a look at these two Nationals players that we have here on the board. Now, both of these guys are left-handed hitters, and it's expected that today's starting pitcher for the Colorado Rockies is going to be Jake Bird. I don't think they've officially announced who's starting yet for the Rockies. I haven't seen anything yet. Maybe the news has dropped by the time you're watching this video, but if it is a right-handed pitcher, I like these left-handed hitters to go under on their strikeout props. Let's take a look at a couple of different projections, and I will let you know why I'm deciding the way that I am. Starting things off here with Corey Dickerson. We're gonna use the Daily Grind Fantasy Optimizer here. Dickerson, Washington Nationals. We're gonna just punch in his name. You can see that based on his line of 0.5 hitter strikeouts, he's got about a 52% chance of going under this particular prop. So things are looking pretty good here. It is a plus EV play. What does that mean? That means positive expected value. If you don't know what that is, well, it's a way for you to get your picks and bets in. And uh, basically we're using the odds pulled from the sports books to help with our decision making. And in this case, we are getting some pretty decent juice here on Corey Dickerson to stay under his hitter strikeout line. But I don't stop there. I don't stop there. You could just use the Daily Grind Fantasy Optimizer and probably be okay and win more often than not over the long run. If you wanna take this Daily Grind Fantasy Optimizer for a spin, I've left a link down in the description of today's video. Guys, you'll save yourself five bucks when you use code Curry. Just go to the description of the video, scroll all the way down to the bottom. I've left a link for you to check out. All right, but I don't stop there, no. I want to take a look at some projections for Dickerson. And for that, we're going to go to the bat by Derek Cardi. Let me increase the size of this so you guys can see it just a little bit better. And when we punch in Corey Dickerson's names, it says he's going against Carl Kaufman. I guess that's the official starting pitcher today, which is fine. Uh, we take a look at his K projection. It is 0 0.40. So that is less than 0 0.50. In other words, he is projecting for closer to zero strikeouts than he is for one strikeout. So things are looking pretty good here. We could also look at a second projection. I've got a second projection. We're going to go to Rotowire for this one. Type in Corey Dickerson's name. You can see that he's projected for 0.19 hitter strikeouts on a line of 0 0.5. Five, zero. Again, we're hoping that he does not strike out today. We hope he gets walked, he flies out, he grounds out, anything but a strikeout, and we will be A-OK -okay with taking the under here. So now that we know that we've got two projection sites that are reputable, that are trustworthy, uh, definitely feeling pretty good about our under on Corey Dickerson. Now, his teammate, Dominic Smith, again, he's another left-handed hitter. The uh, Washington Nationals have not confirmed what their lineup is, but if either one of these guys are in the lineup, just pick whoever is in the lineup. Maybe they both don't make it in today's lineup. Uh, maybe they both do, and maybe you want to take both of them in that case. But whatever the case may be, let's take a look at Dominic Smith real quick. We're going to go back to the Daily Grind Fantasy Optimizer. I haven't looked at this one to see if it's a plus EV play or not. Um, it looks like it is, though. Dominic Smith at a uh, half of a strikeout, 0 .0, or 0 0.5 in this case, 51% chance that he stays under. So again, both of these guys are plus EV plays. It looks like Corey Dickerson, slightly more uh, odds are in your favor a little bit more than, uh, than it is for Dominic Smith. So back to the bat by Derek Cardi. We're going to type in Dominic Smith's name. Uh, he's right here in the middle of these other two Smiths at 0.54 projected Ks, a little bit higher than Corey Dickerson. 
Okay, just a little bit higher. So if you were to ask me who would I rather uh, choose between these two, I guess I would go with Dickerson because he's got the lower projected strikeout. Uh, but either way, both of these guys are pretty good. I'm not afraid of a 0.54 uh, projection here on Smith. So we'll also type in Dominic Smith's name here on RotoWire just to get a second projection. You can see his projections at 0.23. Hitter strikeouts on a line of 0 0.5. So again, both of these guys being left-handed hitters. I think Coffin might be a right-handed pitcher, but either way, the projections are looking pretty good. You could choose either one of these guys, and uh, both of them look pretty good for the under on their hitter strikeout. Which brings us to our third and final pick, which is Logan Allen of the Cleveland Guardians. But before we get into that one, if you're liking what I'm doing here, breaking things down, giving you some projections, giving you the odds behind the picks, I do this regularly. I do this often. It would help me a lot if you hit the subscribe button and hit the like button if this is your first time here. Appreciate all you guys in advance. All right, Logan Allen, Cleveland, Guardians, 89.5 pitches thrown. Let's take a look at this one. Unfortunately, we don't have any sportsbook odds to compare to in this case. So we're just gonna ride with some projections from three different player projection models. Starting again with the bat by Derek Cardi, my favorite one of the bunch. We go ahead and we type in Allen's name here, Logan Allen. His uh, pitching, uh, pitches thrown, I should say, projection is set at 98. Now, what's cool about the bat, uh, compared to some other projection models out there, the bat not only gives you what his, I guess, median or average projected pitches thrown are, but they also give you a projection for like what his baseline pitches are and what his maximum pitches could be for today. So it kind of gives you three different projections. So we take a look at his line. It's at uh, 89.5 over on prize picks, right? But with the bat, the bat is saying that his baseline projected pitches thrown today is 92. So even his baseline is higher than that 89.5 line that prize picks is set for this. So he's projected for 98 today, a baseline of 92, which is kind of like his floor. Think of it that way. Uh, and then you got a ceiling of, of up to 110 pitches that he could potentially go for today. So that kind of gives you a range between 92 and 110, but the bat thinks the sweet spot's gonna be right around 98 pitches thrown. Now, we could stop there, but I'm not going to. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys a couple of other different projections on Logan Allen here. We're gonna use Fantasy Labs for this one. You take a look at this column right here, projected pitch count, 89.5. That is right where Prize Picks has him at 89.5. So that's kind of like, again, a baseline, the lowest potential number, right around 89 to 90 pitches thrown. I'm okay with that projection. But we're gonna take it one step further and show you a third and final projection here using FTN Daily and their pitching uh, projections. So we go down and we find Logan Allen. You can see that he is at 90 projected pitches today, which is more than 89.5 by just a smidge, just a hair, right? But out of the three, the bat is my favorite MLB projection model, and they uh, have him going for more than 89.5. So I'm gonna make this a two pick power play. Those are your three picks that I've come up with. It's a smaller MLB slate. We got a game that's starting here in less than an hour, about 30 to 40 minutes. So I'm gonna take Dom Smith out. I'm gonna go with the other uh, pick, which is Corey Dickerson, who's projected slightly better than the other one. And uh, we'll put 25 bucks on it, two pick power play. Uh, Corey Dicker for, Dickerson for less than uh, 0 0.5 hitter strikeouts with Logan Allen going over 89.5 pitches thrown. And uh, hit place entry and you're good to go. You're off to the races. So guys, if you're tailing, let me know down in the comment section below if you have some other picks that you're interested in. I'd love to hear what you're playing today. Leave a comment for me down there. I try to uh, respond and reply to all the comments that you guys leave on these videos. I appreciate all your support. I will be dropping more videos regularly and often. So make sure you're subscribed with notifications turned on so you don't miss out on any future content. Good luck today on all your picks. Catch you in the next one. Peace.